Hey everybody, I just picked up this great package from Costco. It's a 24 month creative planner from Create365, the Happy Planner, which if you don't know, maybe you do know, I've used a Create365 planner all this year. My first year I used an Erin Condren and it was just, for the cost, I found that this planner worked great for me. This kit is $24.99 at Costco right now. My Costco still had ton, but I'm going to be willing to bet that these go really quickly. I wanted to unbox this whole Create 365 planner kit, go through all of my planner supplies and washi. Okay, so I'm sitting here with all of these planner things laid out in front of me, ready to get ready for 2017. Here's my trash pile, piles of stickers and things that I just know that I won't use, so I'm putting it there. So here I have some binder labels that I do want to keep, but they don't belong in my planner stuff. Here I have all of my Libby & Co stickers, and in all honesty, I need like a little binder just for her stickers, and I do plan on getting a lot more for her. I really do like her stickers, especially because you're paying a decent price and you're getting so many stickers. Like, I am all set for the year for most of these stickers uh, to use, so. I do want to get some sort of system for her and then I do need to work on bill stickers so I have like how to pay our house in here I also have like I had a student loan one from before when we had a student loan but I have like bank ones gas water um, all kinds of bill ones in here so I almost want to make like a bill one I don't know but so I put that here because I'm just not quite sure where I'm gonna put that and then these are from my Erin Condren I just have some plain labels birthday labels, uh, different random ones. So I'm going to go through these and see if I can put any of these um, in my planner for the year. Like obviously I know when birthdays are and stuff like that. And then I did buy some from Aw Snap Planning and I really like her stickers and they're really funny but I would never buy from her again. I bought, bought in July and she was late to make them anyways, later than what she said she was going to, and her time on her site is really long. And then apparently there was like posting issues and she made me wait like two weeks because they couldn't track it or something like that, and then all of a sudden it came, but it came like the week of Thanksgiving. And I just, I had ordered a lot of these like Christmas ones and then Thanksgiving ones, so, and I didn't even get to use them, so. I probably wouldn't order from her again, honestly. I didn't think her customer service was that great. And then these came with my new planner this year. So it's just a bunch of different stickers and I just need to look through and see if I'm gonna do this. I don't typically use like inspirational type things on my planner uh, unless they go with like something. Like in all honesty, if, we, if I was like working out, I would put this one there. So I just got to see if I would use that. And then it did come with like a good to-dos and I really like these Happy Planner to-dos. So I'm definitely going to keep those. We have these two uh, like things that you put in your dashboard or whatever. And I just don't know if I would use them. Uh, so I'm going to put these aside as well. I have my 2018 calendar that needs to get put away. I have some new washi that came through and I'll talk washi in a minute. I have this notepad which I definitely want to use. I really like having a notepad in my planner. The kit that I bought comes with these like pocketed folders so I definitely want to use both of these. I can definitely see a way of using those just putting like you know doctor cards whatever in there. Here is my actual planner, my actual sleeve and the pens that came with it and then for whatever reason I had a random pencil and orange pen in here. And then here is part of a kit I bought last year, I think. So it has like my budget ones in here. Um, and I definitely want to use these, but I don't think I have that many left. So it has the budgeting one, and then I believe it has some other pieces. Yeah, like a weekly cleaning schedule. Um, it has a few of those. It has some weekly meal planners. Um, so I think I'm going to definitely add this stuff in, just some to-do sheets. Probably going to definitely add those in because this was part of the home planner. Uh, so I may put that just at the end of my uh, planner because I think that these, no, maybe they're not tagged. But then I have like extra... Um, like separators or whatever so I can definitely add that into my planner 
to make sure that I'm using all of these pieces. I I have like a bunch of different notebooks going and I kind of want to all like streamline it into my planner. Um, and then I do have a few of these extras from this set that I got over the summer. Maybe it was last summer of these to-dos. And then I have this um, Erin Condren book that I do go to sometimes, but in all honesty, I don't really go to it anymore. But like I could take out these gift tags and put it in my gift tag area um, and just try to focus on using these up. But I don't know. So there's that. I do have my label maker. I do have my sticker maker. And then I do have some holiday stickers. Uh, that probably just need to get put away. I just need to find a good filing system for all this stuff. And then of course I have so much washi that I need to go through because I buy it and I end up using a little bit of it and then I don't use a ton, but I do use it for like my Scentsy business and stuff like that. And then this so far is everything that I won't be using. All right, this is where I'm at now. I have envelopes that I just keep in here because it's easier. And then I have like my uh, label maker and I have my sticker maker and then here is all of my extra so my uh, like sleeves my notepad and my extra planner here I have all note cards thank you cards anything like that because I'll typically put washi and stuff on them here I have all my stickers organized and then here's all the stickers that wouldn't go in there like all those different ones and as you can see I did get rid of a lot and then in here I have all my stickers organized so I have anything to do with the kids the kids like school and sports and stuff like that this is all holiday specific stuff and I have it kind of pinned off for like spring summer fall and winter doctors and dentist stuff Amanda and Jeff this is kind of like date night YouTube anything like that and then this is sets that I've purchased places to go um, adulting I call those ones this is like bill paying and chores around the house uh, anything to do with the animals when we had a cat this obviously had more stickers this is like errands to do these are different to do's and uh, you know things like that to indicate that are things that I use for that headers stuff like that and then I have this one says fun but I think I'm gonna make this one bills and YouTube um, just kind of like that type of stuff and then this is all of my Disney stuff back here and then that takes care of that thing and then my planner itself, I went and organized. So you have your first page, you have your January tab, and then you go into your calendar. I'm going to use my calendar as a, um, like just rough jot of things down that I will like put in pencil and then I can add it into my planner each week as it comes. So I just went through and, you know, Th like threw some stickers in here that I was just basically trying to get rid of so we have uh, that's Trevor's birthday that is my mom's birthday like I know for sure I have a doctor's appointment this day Jeff will be working this whole week um, until here uh, and then this is when we start Disney so I put like that's Simba our dog's name is Simba so that's like I'm gonna write in obviously like take Simba to boarding um, and then I put this because it's the at uh, last is it at last? Yeah, at last I see the light song. So I'm like, this is, you know, when we're going to Disney. Um, and then I put uh, Bri Rabbit, like running. So this is when we, we're gonna be leaving sometime around here to go to Disney. This day will be my mom's birthday and we'll be in Magic Kingdom. And then I put like all of the Epcot stickers here. Uh, so maybe we can check off like if we go to all those countries and then we will be in Hollywood Studios into Epcot this day and then Animal Kingdom this day. I think we're going to do Disney Springs that night. And then this is my Magic Kingdom day. Um, I'm, I don't really plan when we're in Disney. I don't bring my planner. So this is just more so fun. And then I'll obviously plan whenever we come back. Because the kids will be back to school these two days. And, you know, everything. So there is that. Uh, and then I also put in after the month. I put in my home planner. So I put in the... Uh, budget which will be here and I kind of do budgeting by season so this can like just kind of transfer over and then I put a divider and then I put in the weekly cleaning schedule which I think I'm gonna find some way to do it so it's like a monthly cleaning schedule 
and then I have a to-do list so I can make like my to-do list or my goals that month and then I have grocery list and um, meal plan and I'm gonna do meal plan by the month so there should be enough for four or five you know of each day um, if there's any special occasions and I'm gonna try this year to grocery shop for the month and just have to go and get like a few things or send my husband so that's all set for there. I do have these pins. Now I'm going through my washi. Um, I need to get rid of some. So these are some of the new washies that came in that little uh, kit that I got for from Costco. And then here's all kinds of seasonal washies that I bought throughout the year. Uh, some still in the tags. And then I have these washies. So I'm going to go through and decide what I haven't used what I won't use, you know, when I was starting out, I was trying to get some washies, uh, see what I can use for Scentsy, because I do use like a scent of the month, and I typically put washi tape on it, um, and then see what we have that's the same. So I'm going to lay all this stuff out. Okay, so I have, I think, all of my Christmas and Halloween set off to the side here, just making sure, yeah. So, and then I have like all my glitters. So I do like all of these, even though they don't work the best, but I do like them. So I'm going to go ahead and keep all of these. And then these are all of my fall and Halloween. Oh, that's spring. Uh, fall and Halloween and all those ones. So I think um, I need to go through these. So like, I don't really like either of these in all honesty. I know I'm not keeping that one. Um, I think that's a good you know, mix for fall. So I'm going to set those aside because I'm not going to put those on this rack because it's too hard to keep them all. Here are my Christmas ones again. And I actually used up some this year, so I'm not like a complete hoarder. Um, so I have this happy Hall holidays one, which I do really like. I saw someone use this and I didn't like that. So I'm going to put that one away. Don't really like that one either. In all honesty, I like this one. This one's a maybe. Here are all my Valentine's Day ones, heart ones, love ones, and I do like all of these still, so I'm keeping those. And then I have this like ruler one for school, that one for parties, and like this is part of the new one that I'd probably use with parties too, so I do like all of those. I have these two that I could like give or take. Again, some of these are just like give or take, but they do have a bunch of different colors, but it's like do I need all these blues and teals? Um, I have a gold, a black and white, and then I have these thin ones. Are thinner ones which I do like using to separate my weekends but I honestly don't love the colors of any of those so I'm just gonna put those over there I have these two little ones that I've had for forever and don't ever use so I'm putting these over there then these ones remind me of Disney so I'm definitely keeping those and then like I said I have my sparklies so I don't know if I'm gonna keep any of these like I do like those I actually do like that one too See, these ones are I'm like torn on. So I'm going to put these aside and see if I have room for them. So now I'm going to try to put all of the non-holiday ones in here and see how far I can get. All right, so there we go. We have everything. So I have a fall, a Halloween, a couple Christmas, some just regular Valentine's Day, some more Valentine's Day. I'm going to use this one up, I know for sure, this year. A school one, and then I figured this could just be kind of year-round. And then some kind of like celebration-y ones, birthday ones, some year-round ones. These ones remind me of Disney. And then I have all of my glitter ones here. So now I have all of those all set. And I'm going to make sure that I don't buy any more washi unless I can fit it on here. So i got to use up what I have. Um, and then here are all the ones I'm going to get rid of. So I have those two. These are the first washies I ever bought. Actually, I think these were two. I think these are, this one's scotch. This one I think is Dollar Tree. I know some of these I was gifted to. Uh, the tree one never been opened. This Halloween one never been opened. Some of these. Some of these. Some of these. And then I also am going to gift these two little flags that I just won't use. So I figured I'd throw them in here. Or like list. And then I have this football sticker. I have this thing that again I won't use. And then I have this set, which is the mini binder accessories, and it has like page flags, stickers, and then I have this fall paper thing. So I don't know if anyone is interested. If you are, I'm going to offer this as a kind of like pass it on to you type of thing because some of this stuff is used. So if this is would be something that you're interested in, just say, yes, I am interested in it and say, what is your one planner accessory item that you hoard? 
we all do it, I'm sure. Uh, but yeah, so I am really happy to go into the new year and have this all organized, have my planner all set up, have some pins ready to go, and my washi kind of pared down and all that stuff that I can throw away.